Hi, I'm Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to create an animated GIF file using GIMP. Let's go to our computer. And first let's make sure we have the GIMP, which is an image editing program, by opening up our web browser and going to GIMP.org. Now click on the Downloads section and then scroll down until you see the Windows version of GIMP. You just click there to download and install the program. Now once you have GIMP installed, it will appear in your Start menu under All Programs. You'll find GIMP. Let's just open it up. Now the first time you launch it, it could take a little bit of time to open because it's setting everything up. I've already launched it once before, so it pops right up. Now, let's start our animation by going to File and then New. I'm going to make this uh, 200 pixels by 200 pixels. I'm going to click OK. So I'm given a white screen here and a single layer called background. I'm going to draw something interesting on this. Just some, you know, some shapes of some kind. Just like that. Now, let's, open, let's create a new layer in our Layers tab by right clicking in the white area and clicking on New Layer. I want to have a white background. And I can show and hide layers by clicking on the little eyeballs that are next to each layer. So if I want to show my background, I just have it showing. If I want to show the new layer, I'd only select the eye on it. So I'm going to draw some other shapes here, just some little lines. Now what's going to happen is each layer is going to become a frame in our animation. And the way that we're going to do that is by renaming each of them and adding a timing in milliseconds to the name. Let's say 2000 milliseconds would mean that the background frame will display for uh, two seconds. It has to be in parentheses like that. So let's double click it. And this one I want to display for 1000 milliseconds. I don't think my 2000 took here, so I'm going to retype it. So I have two frames. The first one will show for two seconds and the second for one second. Let's view a preview by going to Filters, Animation, and then Playback, and click Play. As you can see, our animation is displaying. Now let's save this as a GIF file by going to File, Save As. I'm going to put it on my desktop. I'm going to call it animation.gif. You have to check Save as Animation and click Export and then Save. Now on my desktop, I have a file. It's a GIF image. If I open it up, you'll see the animation playing in your web browser. I'm Dave Andrews, and I've just showed you how to create an animated GIF using the GIMP. 